Sometimes I get the tone of the joke wrong, right? You know, you get a problem, whatever. But sometimes it could just be anything I do. It could be dressing like this, and people get mad. Your anger has nothing to do with me. Yeah, it goes back to what we're talking about. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't, why are you angry? Like, yeah. that didn't make any sense. Right? right. And so, like, okay, cool. Like, if I offended you, sorry, but, like, I don't know, like, the filter that you're looking at this through is not the filter that I'm using. Yes. You know, and I don't blame you so for that. So that's perspective. Yeah. But, like, I'm not going to be worried about that. Yes. You know what I'm saying? Hold yes. You over that. Well, because you know what your intention, right, what your intention yeah, yeah. is. It's, it's kind of funny because, like, obviously I'm short, I'm Italian, but I, I'm a black belt, like, I have muscle, like, I'm, I'm pretty secure in myself. People really ever talk shit to me. Yeah. And well, I also don't put myself in that situation, but I would. But, like, even when they do, like, you know, when some people try to, like, vote, I say, are you trying to bully me? Yeah, you like, just call it out. Like, obviously not going to work on me. Right. Right? Um, and from a male perspective, it's not like you're going to beat me up. So you, there's no threat here. You know what I'm saying? So I can just handle it totally different. Yes. But, yeah, it's kind of funny because, like, you know, but also that's the position I put myself in. If I didn't do jujitsu, if I wasn't muscular, if I wasn't confident, that yeah, you could bully me. Yeah. And I think when you work very hard to get to where you're at, you are equipped to handle situations differently. You are. Right? Believe it or not, when that whole thing happened with that man calling me a bitch, you know what I did at the time? I cried because I wasn't who I am right now. If it were now, I would, <laughs> I would have handled it very differently. Yeah. What I did was I cried, got myself together, then handled it the way I should have. But I needed that time to, you know, because I didn't, I, although again, I'm going to go back to what I said before. That experience helped mold me to who I am now. Hello, my name is Dr. Mark Bachner. Don't forget to check out my new book, Pug Learns to Believe.